Om Shalom, daughters of Yah. It is me, Malcolm Marie, your favorite big sister, mentor, and life coach. You know, one of the foundational purposes of Titus 2 Life Coaching is to support women in their walk with the Father through prayer, scripture reading, scripture study, and helping out their actual walk. Prayer will always be the primary spiritual pillar and habit which we must use to nurture and grow. It is how we stay intimate with the Father. Communication is a cornerstone of all good relationships, including our relationship with Abba. Scripture reading is necessary because it aids in the transformation of the carnal mind to the mind of Messiah. If you eat daily to feed your physical well-being, then you should be eating the word daily for your spiritual well-being. Scripture study is needful to go deeper in the word. Learning the character of the Most High and adjusting our ways of thinking and understanding is paramount to our walk. The following scripture sums it up pretty well, the importance and need of study. In 2 Timothy chapter 2, verse 15, it says, Study to show yourself approved unto Elohim, a workman that needs not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. Titus 2 Life Coaching is inviting you to build the study habit with weekly sisterhood Bible studies on Zoom. We will meet, y'all willing, January 16th, 2024 at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And every Tuesday after that, we will start off by studying some Bible basics and move on to the Gospel of John. If you haven't guessed it, John is my favorite gospel. This is the gospel we read through when we did our daily reading challenge a few years back. It might be time for another reading challenge now that I think about it. We will study the gospel through a Hebraic point of view. Most of us came out of a Christian background and might be used to studying it from a Western English pair of lens. We will not be throwing out the baby with the bathwater, but we will complement the study within its correct Hebraic background. We will be mindful of Hebrew idioms of the time. We will be mindful of the different resources that were available to the body at the time. And we will answer thought-provoking questions like, who were the rabbis? We have a four-point goal. One, build the habit of sitting with the word among sisters and studying. Two, learn about the Father through the scriptures. After all, the scriptures teach us about him. Three, have the scriptures transform us by renewing our mind. Our minds are renewed by putting in new information, challenging old information, and discarding anything that does not line up with scripture. And four, acquire or increase our Bible literacy. Bible literacy allows us to be able to have an answer for anyone who might answer, ask the question, what is the hope that we have in us? If this sounds like something you need in your life, then register for the class at bit.ly forward slash study sis. It is case sensitive, so use all caps. Spaces are limited. It will be first come first serve with preference to those newer in the faith. Those mature in the faith are welcome to register and I trust their wisdom will add to the class but we really want to extend the classes to those who are new or may not be well rooted in the faith in the faith i also cordially invite young women that were raised in the faith which may need or have a desire to make the understanding of the way that they were raised in their own come and get the understanding why we do what we do after registration you can expect to receive a syllabus for the class, you will also receive login information for Zoom, maybe about a week or so before classes begin. If you have any questions, you can reach me at Titus2LifeCoaching at gmail.com. As always, it is me, Martha Marie, your favorite big sister mentor and life coach. Shalom Queens.